Hi guys! Today I had a fashion incident, so we decided to customize my denim jacket! And she will be the only owner of such a jacket! Yes, Sammy! I can't wait to see the result! First, we need to lay it flat on the table. Let's start with the back. Sammy, bring me the sketch, please! Always ready to help! Thank you, Sammy! I'm so glad that you're here! Let's transfer the sketch onto the jacket. And for this, we need a regular pencil. Since it's denim fabric, try to put more effort into this so the lines can be clearly visible. Susie, where did you learn how to draw so well? Oh, Sam, it was a long process of trial and error. So guys, never be afraid of trying something new and experimenting. This is so true, guys. I learned everything from the first try. <laughs> <laughs> Sammy modesty is defo, not your virtue. A talented slime can literally do everything, Susie. Ah, got it, Sammy. <laughs> but I also have multiple talents. Wow, the drawing looks really cool! Uh, what about the front part? It's also okay, as you can see. We repeated here the main elements from the back side. This style is called sketch. Wow, that's what I call real art! How about brightening things up? Shoo, I'm absolutely in! And for this, we'll need the paint. What do you think? Which color should go first? Susie, I think we'd better start, uh, with the blue paint. As you say, Sammy, blue it is. Guys, you can use any colors you like. It's totally up to you. Get creative. By the way, Sammy, what do you call it when you take old clothes and decorate, re-sew, cut, and make something new from it? <laughs> I guess you call it money saving? <laughs> no, Sammy, it's called upcycling. Now it's a trend and many people from all over the world enjoy giving new life to old things. Nowadays, people buy too many clothes that just pile up in their wardrobe and later their owners just throw them away. It's not good for the environment. You know? But if you keep upcycling your old clothes, where would you get new material for future projects? You wouldn't go and buy new ones in brand shops for this, would you? That's why thrift shops have become so popular now. You can find so many pretty things there. For example, you can take a vintage men's shirt and with a few needle moves, turn it into a cool dress. You can be creative in so many ways. We are done with this part. Let's add some brighter shades. How do you like it, guys? So, this guy looks kind of scary. Make him a shiny white smile. Okay, we'll start with the upper jaw. Guys, don't forget to take good care of your teeth and don't eat too many sweets like Garsami. <laughs> Slimes don't have to visit the dentist, but people do, and that's uh, not the kind of event that can be called fun. <laughs> You're right, too, but if you brush your teeth regularly, then you won't have any problems. I chose a cartoon style for my jacket. It always looks great. What do you think, Sammy? Oh, I love cartoons, too, but they can be different, you know. Is it gonna be from Gravity Falls? Adventure Time? Disney? Wow, Sammy, you've got a vast knowledge in the animation field, I see. Of course, I am a well-known expert in cartoonology. I decided to make a collage from different funny elements. For me, it's much more fun than staying within any specific cartoon style limits. 
This gives you more space for creativity, but you can defo draw your favorite animated characters if you want. Here we go! So I want to follow the trench too, so I made this beautiful piece by myself. Actually, I had to finish all the cookies for that. <laughs> <laughs> Sammy, nice little step towards upcycling. In the meantime, we're going to use some black. It will look great on our jacket. Hmm, which one should I choose next? Let's do this one. Oh, guys, time flies when you're talking while working. <laughs> yes, the main thing here is to find an interesting conversationalist, and here I am. Oh, Sammy, you're so modest. And I'm gonna color this cloud with teal paint. Or should I call it mint? Anyways, it looks very beautiful on this blue denim fabric, even though the colors are somewhat related to each other. Oh, I love the color mint. It reminds me of mint ice cream. Guys, you like mint ice cream? If yes, then give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Now let's color this funny tongue. So, how much work do we have to do? Kinda tired already. <laughs> and hungry. Not much, actually. We need to finalize some details and it'll be done. Don't go anywhere! So this is so mesmerizing, I can't stop looking. Yes, yeah, Sammy, it came out great, but we still need to finish the contours. Is that necessary? The drawing is already perfect! Patience, Sammy. Contouring will make it even better. You'll see very soon. Guys, no need to rush here. Go slowly and try not to make a mess with the textile marker. So, have you ever thought about what the word denim means? Hmm. <laughs> Don't answer. <sighs> I want to tell you anyways. <clears throat> the material came from a French city called Nims. Denims means from Nims in English. Cool, right, Sue? <laughs> I'm glad you use your smartphone not only for challenges, Sammy. Maybe you'll find something about the word jeans? Of course. And French has something to do with it, too. The word comes from the French name for the city of Genoa, which is jeans. Hmm. You know, I've been thinking of learning French. Actually, I can tell you something, too. Do you know the first name for jeans? Uh, let me think. Uh, blue trousers? A working uniform. Durable clothes? <laughs> wow, such an imagination. You almost guessed it. The name was Waste Overalls. Shiver me shatters! I was so close! <sighs> Don't be so upset, Sammy. I have one more question for you. What was the color of the first jeans? Hmm. Uh, let it be blue. It's classic. And, and black? Your first answer was correct, but it was called indigo blue. As for the second one, it was called brown cotton duck. <laughs> Half a victory is better than defeat, isn't it? You know, sometimes it's not about winning the race, it's just about being part of it. Right, guys? Hey, Sue, I was just thinking, do you really want to wear this denim jacket? Because I also have some plans in this regard. <laughs> Sammy, I think it's a little too big for you. Don't you think so? But if you really want, you can also wear it from time to time. <laughs> I can share it with you. With that said, I came up with a wearing schedule. Have a look and sign it, please. Uh, let me see. Hmm, it seems to me there's some confusion here. So, if I assign too many days for you, then uh, tell me, I'll fix that right away. <laughs> oh, Sammy, very funny. Oh, Sue, why so serious? It was just a prank. <laughs> I got it, Sammy. And now get ready for some magic. Voila!
Hi guys, it's time for magic transformations. Where's my partner, by the way? Ahem. <clears throat> ah, coming! Do I look like an enchanted animal? <laughs> I just wanted to feel a Disney princess vibe. Now let's come back to modern times. Did you mean modern fairy tale? Bibbidi bobbidi boom! I don't think we can transform the jacket like this. <laughs> Let's just use the old-fashioned way and draw the outlines with a simple pencil. This way. Our first character is famous for his huge ears. Who do you think he is, guys? <laughs> We're also gonna need to draw his long nose. <laughs> right you are! I was talking about Dumbo! There, the outline of our first character is done. Sammy, who will be next? I think I got what you mean, Sammy. Then let's get started. <laughs> Guys, did you guess which character Sammy chose? Of course, it's Mickey. Mickey's a real superstar. He even has his own star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Cool, right? Oh, then I'm very lucky to have a photo with him. Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> yup, he got his star more than 40 years ago. Can you believe that? That's amazing. Are you hungry? Maybe you'll find some snacks in the kitchen. No, that was Mickey's first ever phrase. Um, until we have something yummy. Oh, I got it. And this is Mickey's famous glove. Check it out. Hmm, but at first he didn't have any. When did he find it? The animators drew it to make his gestures more precise. <laughs> and I, bright things movements are very visible. <laughs> Sammy. Do you know what is the most important about a fairy tale? The magic wand! Uh, fairy godmother! Uh, oh, I know! A unicorn! <laughs> yeah, but first of all, it's a good story. There are lots of them here in the endless storybook. And first Disney cartoons about princesses started with the book opening. Hmm. Guys, if you're Disney fans like us, give us a thumbs up. <laughs> Check this out, Sammy. Guys, do you recognize all these characters? I promise it'll be easier to guess. Cause now we'll start coloring! I love this part! And I want to start with this mischievous fellow. <laughs> oh yeah, I believe we have common ancestors! <laughs> Misbehaving is in your DNA. And dancing hula playing a ukulele! <laughs> Guys, did you recognize this character? Hmm? Oh, I'm sure they did. It's Stitch from Lilo and Stitch. Aw, check out this cute little alien. Now, let's add a lighter color for the highlights. This will help us make him more three-dimensional. <laughs> Stitch, be patient. There. Oh, he's certainly up to something. Keep an eye on him, Sue. All right, Sue, what character will be next? Here are the two main characters from the same animated film. Who do we choose? Hmm, let's flip a coin and pick one. Oh, tips on Noah! Noah! Oh, Simba! I want Simba! Oh. Okay, I guess no one expected this. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so what if we color them both at the same time? That's a great idea, Sammy. I'll pick Simba. And I'll color Noah. All right, here we go! <laughs> With just the outlines, they look pretty similar. Yeah, Simba is kind of yellowish, like the sun. Well, of course, he's a future king after all. Aw, check out her lovely pink nose. And Simba has a dark, um, ear liner, I'd say. <laughs> ah, a gift for a real queen. Oh, wait, she's literally a gift herself, right? <laughs> 
Maria. Her name Nala means gift and beloved. And the name Simba literally means lion in Swahili. Hmm, how is Rafiki able to read the future? I don't get it! <laughs> Maybe you should try with coconut pieces, huh? But he'll have to get one first. <laughs> yeah, I'd better ask this fella to fly and bring me one. <laughs> Guys, you do know who's the best at flying, right? And he doesn't even need wings for it. How cool is that? It is said that Dumbo was Walt Disney's favorite animated film. Guys, and do you like this brave baby elephant? Then give him a thumbs up. And do you remember that you wanted to help me, huh? Oh, right! <laughs> uh, can I call her Alice in Wonderland? <laughs> sure you can, Sammy. While Sammy's coloring Alice, we're moving to the next character. And this is Thumper, Bambi's friend. How's it going, Sammy? All done! I guess I finished first! Again! <laughs> mm, yeah, you might be the quickest slime, but I also colored Pluto. <laughs> Wait, I could have used magic? In that case, I'd have everything colored! <laughs> well, Disney is the magic world, so we can't do without magic today, right? <laughs> Guys, we ain't finished yet, so give a thumbs up and stay tuned! By the way, what do you think that Magic Mickey's book is about? Hmm, I think it's about Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. That was the first Disney animated movie! Alright, in the meantime, we'll start coloring the book. <gasps> it's coming out so awesome! Right, guys? Oh, I can only imagine what great adventures are hiding in here! And what Disney fairy tale would you like to enter, Sammy? <laughs> hmm, I'd say Lion King. I would totally save Mufasa. And I think I'd like to write my own fairy tale. <gasps> oh, can I be one of the characters too? Oh, you'll be one of the main characters, Sammy. I can't imagine my life without you. <laughs> oh, our fairy tale book is done. We finished the craft quick today. Wait a moment. Everything looks good, but something is kind of missing. <gasps> That's a Disney jacket, Sue! We're missing fairy lights or something! Huh? I'm already applying some fairy dust. Check out how beautiful it is. Let's add some bright splashes, too! <laughs> okay, I can add some random blue brush strokes. This way. Oh, I know! Can we also create some cool writings? Sure thing, Sammy. That's a great idea! Sue, so that's simply awesome! Guys, see for yourselves! Guys, did you like our denim jacket? I really love it. It came out just fabulous. <laughs> Ooh, that was fun. Sammy, what do you think? It's cool, Sue. You managed to bring my drawings to life. Right. I'm glad we could turn your idea into reality. Guys, we wouldn't deal without your help. Yeah, that's true. By the way, Sue, what was that about some Disney party? All right. It's time to begin preparations. Guys, if you liked our 
your Disney jacket, give us a thumbs up, and we're going to the party! And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'll see you very soon. Bye-bye!